You can look around the room, and the amount of friends you guys hear says everything. Uh, you guys got some really great friends. It's it's such a joy to like be around both of you. They have the most infectious laugh. It's just such a such a joy to be around both of you. You guys know Mercer. He tries to make meaningful connections. He's like, okay, you want to talk about the weather? Peace. I'm not about that life. He's like, you want to talk about music or you want to talk about like something more deep than that? He'll listen and do it. And he draws people in that want to do that. And I think everyone in this room is awesome. It's like I've met so many incredible people just through Mercer because that's who he attracts. He has that way about him and that kind of magneticism to draw in people that are awesome and keep them in his orbit. I think everyone in this room can agree that if you know my sister, you know, well, this is embarrassing. Uh, you know that she is one of the most outgoing, joyful, funniest people I know, besides my mom. Sorry, Dad. Um, and I've seen, I've seen Audrey firsthand countless times use those qualities to make people feel known and special, even in the simplest conversations. Having a bad day, Audrey can and will act out the latest SNL scene or seen from a movie to perfection and make you laugh out loud. Thank you, Audrey Kroll, the most important Kroll. You're kind, you're, you're caring, you're a comedian, you're smart, I mean, I, I am the luckiest guy in the world. The full package. So thank you. For, thank you for saying yes. Thank you. Love you. Thank you. And I didn't have anything prepared about you, but now I would like to tell everyone. My, my, I just, my favorite things, and everyone touched on this, Austin is the most empathetic, and that's what makes you so cool and confident, because you're just focused on other people, and so lighthearted and hilarious, and great job. Great job. Give me a kiss to fill a dream on And my imagination will drive upon that kiss Oh, sweetheart, I ask no more than this A kiss to fill a dream on Give Audrey, a kiss Austin started a smiling a lot more And then we met you Pretty lady, smart, a great sense of humor, and a deep faith in God. Can't ask for a better combination. Thank you, Brian and Polly, for raising such a wonderful person. Be with you, weaving romances, making believe. I was living with Mercer when he met her for the first time, went on a day with her, came home, started talking about her, and I was like, this girl doesn't sound real. Like, she sounded way too good to be true, so I was like, we'll see if she actually exists. And then he brought her home one night, and it was all true. As everyone knows, Austin and Audrey were set up by our sister Lou. When they first started dating, I had heard great things, but had yet met, met her. So I had the opportunity to meet Audrey and Nola New Year's Day at a bar on Bourbon. From that first meeting, I knew Austin had met someone special. We all know God works in mysterious ways. And who would have thought a babysitting job would have led to a husband? I just wanted to say how proud I am of her. And I'm like, uh, uh, how proud I am of her and uh, how much I love her. And uh, all through her life, I've learned a lot about loving your children, but also about having to let them go. 
Lord. It does get emotional. It does. I'm letting Aubrey go. And she loves and wants to spend the rest of her life with you. And that's the greatest blessing you can give a parent. I kiss the bill I dream of. It's the most overused speech cliche ever, but to know Audrey is to love Audrey. Obviously, everyone is touching on it. She's the most thoughtful, caring friend you'll ever have, the most hilarious friend. Every conversation we have, we can barely get through without laughing. And yet, she still finds a way to check in on you and your life and ask how you're doing. Sophistication, and you got yourself a fine education, and I'm so proud of your good reputation. I love everything about you. feel so comfortable being myself all the time. I remember when you weren't together with Austin and we had a trip to Park City with Polly and I have never seen Audrey so sure. And you've always just sort of taken life by the horns and I don't think you give yourself enough credit for how much you actually put into life and we're all lucky to have you in our lives in general and we're so proud of you and I don't know if anyone tells you that. I'm sure your parents tell you that. <laughs> As friends, as friends, we're so proud of you and we're so happy to be here celebrating you today. But I remember sending a message to Polly one day, which by the way, everything we all said about her could be said about her. My eyes. That's true. But I told her, I said, you know what? I'm feeling great about life. What I want to be is strong. I want to feel beautiful. I want to make people feel beautiful. I want to be smart. I want to be successful. And I went and thought about that. Done. I want to be successful. <laughs> people don't know, but Austin was actually the most popular kid in our high school, our senior year. And I'm not like just making this up, we actually did superlatives, and usually you see this at high school, right, like it's the captain of the football team, something like that. No, it was Austin Mercer. And I think it has a lot to do with a few things. I think number one, it's because obviously he's an amazing person and he's friends with everybody. But I also have to give some uh, some love over to my man Big Will over here. Let me guess. This is Audrey's and that's Austin. No, it's the other way around, buddy. When you think about a partnership and a duo, these two apart as individuals are incredible. Like I've talked about Audrey, she's amazing. I've talked about Merzer, she's amazing. But when you guys put them together, you're extraordinary. You're someone that when I watch this next joyride together you guys are gonna go through and creating a life together, I am so excited. 
Like you are going to crush life, guys. It's gonna be amazing because I know together you're gonna do stuff in this world that we're all gonna be in awe. Audrey, you're, a, you're an attorney. No reps and warranties, and certainly no returns. And now if you'd raise your glasses, quote from Martin Luther, let Audrey make Austin glad to come home, and let him make her sorry to see him leave. Bless you. <laughs> <laughs>